Hey guys, Alex here. Today I'm going to show you step by step how to set the Wi-Fi up on a SoFar inverter. First things first, you'll need an iPhone or an iPad with cellular data. First step guys is to mount the Wi-Fi dongle inside the inverter. Most of the time the installer would have already done this for you. Okay guys, the first step of the connection process is to log into the inverter's Wi-Fi through the serial number and password given to you on the front of the Wi-Fi dongle. Now guys, if you open up your Wi-Fi settings on your mobile phone or tablet, you should see the serial number of the Wi-Fi dongle pop up. If you click on that one and type in the password given to you on the front of the Wi-Fi dongle. And now we are connected. Now guys, step two of the connection process is logging into the portal online and connecting the inverter's Wi-Fi to the customer's Wi-Fi. To access the portal, open up your internet browser and type in 10.10.100.254. The login for that portal is username is admin and password is admin. Now we're logged into the portal. In the navigation column on the left, you'll see an option wizard. If you click on that, you will be able to find the customer's Wi-Fi and log in. Now, once you've found your home Wi-Fi, if you click on that, make sure it's highlighted and press next. Now type in your home Wi-Fi password. And press next. Next again, and OK. Now, if your Wi-Fi router is within range and the password you typed in is correct, all three of these display lights should go out for two seconds and come back on with the net light solid green. Now the net light is solid green, you've successfully paired the inverter's Wi-Fi to your home Wi-Fi. Now the next step is to get connected to the SolarMan app. The next step is to download the correct SolarMan app from your preferred app store. Next step is registering on the SolarMan app. For the initial setup, you want to click on build plant within one minute. I don't have installer, continue to create. So now you can manually enter the serial number or scan the serial number with your camera. Once the Wi-Fi dongle has been scanned, you will enter your plant information. Now we're filling out the plant information. Plant address, capacity of kilowatts, currency, and benchmark price. Benchmark price is the price your retailer will be paying you per kilowatt fed back to the grid. Next step is to register with your preferred email address and password. Once you have registered, you will have to confirm the information you previously put in. If all is correct, push next. Plant name is your name and press done. If all is correct, once you have finished registering, you should see a green tick up the top of the screen here. Can take 10 to 15 minutes in order for that green tick to show. 